Hi, my name's Daddy, and I play Boom Beach sometimes. Hello there, um, my name's Nate, and my dad just downloaded Boom Beach on my iPad. <laughs> yeah, funnily enough, <coughs> you wake up in the morning and there's a, there's a beta of Supercell's brand new game. So, what we, thought, what we thought that we could probably do today in this video is just talk you through um, the attacking strategy in the game uh, and show you a few things. Um, this is going to be the last um, Boom Beach video that I'm doing after that Nate is going to take over, is that yeah, right? So, I like loads of people are doing Clash of Clans like Flammy and Play Clash of Clans and all, that pe all those people. So I kind of gave up on my dad and yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> sorry, sorry about that. Sorry. Yeah, so, um, so I once gone to Boom Beach, I'm sure there's no gamers out there. Yeah, excellent. So um, please go and check out Nate's um, channel. Nate's channel is going to be linked in the comments. Uh, and it's going to be sort of keeping on the family business, I think, yeah. really, yeah, <laughs> making Supercell related games. So, um, yeah, so I should mention this is only available in the Canadian iTunes store. So, uh, I just want to show you sort of a few of the dynamics. So, first of all, you've got the headquarters, and that's like a town hall. I'm sort of trying to relate this to Cash Cash, yeah. right? Yeah, <laughs> the way I answer. Um, so, you've got the town hall in the middle, and once that, gone, once that is gone, you're dead. You know, everything is kind of disappeared. And you can upgrade that. But I think like Clash, we don't really upgrade yeah. them too fast, do we? Yeah. <laughs> so overnight, when I, you know, I've been sleeping, Nate's uh, got the mortar just there. So yeah. the mortar, obviously, strongest defensive. It's, yeah, it's, it's like, like a mortar. mortar. Yeah, it's like a mortar, right? <laughs> you got the archer towers. Sorry. Right. <laughs> and then uh, we've got some resource buildings, right, mate? Have you so, seen any? That's like the gold mine, probably, and that's probably the elixir pump. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Otherwise known as uh, the wood. The, the wood, yeah. This sawmill. Now you can harvest the wood as well by cutting down these trees. So you get young mangroves and all sorts of, you know, mangrove yeah. rows. And, and uh, it costs gold to mark, cut down the, the, the things, the, the trees. Yeah. So all these are upgradable. Um, and then we've got our attacking force, right? Oh, look, you can put the bomb. <laughs> yeah, you can do it nice get in <laughs> to get your attacking force. And there's two of those. So there's your troops that you can send to other lands, and then there's the um, gunboat which bombards the other land with. Um, I've used about three or four, I think, is it? The, the big bombs that can weaken the defences. And all of these could be upgraded. And in fact, the gunboat, the landing craft could be upgraded to. Uh, oops, sorry, the landing craft could be upgraded to get more troop capacity. And uh, we don't yet have enough wood to do that, but once you do it, it gives you more space so you can attack with more troops. Okay, so we've got troops. The nice thing is in this game that once you've attacked somebody, the troops that aren't dead and aren't killed actually stay. That'd be cool, right? Yeah. <laughs> so they just, you can use them again. <laughs> it's good because you don't get any troops. Right, so that's what you've got. So you produce resources and you attack troops. Now when you want to find people to attack, you have to upgrade your radar to, to be able to discover more of this sort of clown. clown you know? And these, of course, get more expensive. The first First one was about two hundred and eighty gold, and now it's two thousand eight hundred gold. So you have to get building. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and then when you open up more land, you get to discover more, um, more, more people to attack. Now this is kind of weird because it's kind of a hybrid between. Uh, so let's let's attack this guy. So it's a hybrid between single player and multiplayer. Uh, <coughs> right. So I'm going to try and weak. This is a. Um, so machine gun, so I'm trying to weaken it a little bit, use a couple of them, cool. isn't that awesome? And then we're going to send in, send in this big guy, he's a bit more tanky than the, than the infantry. So I'm going to put the infantry behind. They actually take quite a lot of, uh, I don't know, shots, oops. We're going to send in some more, there we go, bang, here we go, there we go. There we go. Now what happens is you take you take this out <laughs> and something funny happens. Have you seen this yet? You, no, it's quite early, right? Nope. Right. So you get a medal, which is good. You know, that's like the yeah. trophy system. That's your ranking. Yeah. Come on. Right. So obviously it's it's a beta version of the game. So the you know the graphics are interesting, but they're not really they're not really you know as polished yeah. as you'd expect. People pop it out. Yeah, the little shots pop out. <laughs> and the thing is that as they you've rescued them, they now start paying you money or gold. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? So if you go now back to that, you see that's been opened up. 
and it's 40 gold per hour. And that 40 gold, um, oh yeah, do you want to pop the, uh, I think that should be some free, free diamonds, yay, get in there, okay. Yeah. So that 40, uh, sorry, that 40 gold per hour arrives in the form of a little boat. Oh yeah, I think. And that's the boat there. So that's how it works. The more uh, you yeah. save, the more your income grows. Yeah, I, I was wondering about about one of these here. So I think it's, it's this one that I think you did yeah, this morning. Exactly. Should we open up another part of the world, see what there is? Sure. Yeah. Uh, so click on world. Yeah, and then just select one of the ones that have got gold and numbers next to each other. Hey. Oh great, you've got a, um, a ch chest. So the chests were part of Heyday, which is quite interesting, and the railing's part of Clash, of course. So you've got a few more, so if you want to check one of those, and then just scout them out. Oh, we'll do the scout, yeah. So yeah, you can check it out, really. So there's 1,300 gold, 740 of that, and then there's these machine guns. So the belly, you, you can sort of see them in advance. Now, there's one that I wanted to show you, which is this one here. So this is Hubsy. He's a person. He's level six, and this is his... Oh, a real person. A real person, yeah. Oh, that's good. So you can actually check him out before you attack him. <laughs> there we go. He's got a big one. Well, if he's actually online, doesn't he? Can't you attack him? I haven't yet figured that out, if they're online. Because on Clash Clans, if you do a revenge, that's not like. Yeah, you have to be offline, don't you? Yeah. I'm sure that I attacked him when I wanted to, and it didn't actually say the player's on... I, I have a feeling. The nice thing is, if you attack him and you fail, then you, as I did, because yeah. I had weak creeps, then you can go back and attack him again. Yeah. But what I find weird is that they have those mines showing. So I know. It's like. <laughs> What's the point, really? Yeah. <laughs> You'd expect them to be hidden, wouldn't you, really? Yeah. So, so that's it. I mean, look, it's, it's an early day. It's early stages. But as, yeah. as time goes on, uh, you know, I'm sure that they'll upgrade it and that um, it makes it much better. <coughs> Any thoughts, mate? Mm, yeah, I quite like it actually. It's, it's like Clash Clans and Heyday yeah. together. It's a bit of, surprise, surprise! It's yeah. made by Supercell. Yeah. It's kind of a, it's kind of a, it's yeah. none of these fake mm. Clash of Clans. It's some of the real stuff. Yeah. So there will be comparisons, of course, with things yeah. like Battle Beach and, and yeah. some other you know, yeah. fake Clash of Clans. Clash, <laughs> Clash of Kings. Clash of Kings. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's about thirty of them out there. Aren't yeah. They? Anyway. So I hope you enjoyed that. Was yeah. that okay, mate? You reckon? Good, okay. So Nate is going to be taking over with the Boom Beach videos from now. So check out his channel, it's linked in the comments. Um, he'll make videos probably as frequently as I can if he can, but you know it's like with school and uh, yeah. stuff. Okay, so going to upgrade, rec uh, recover the troops, so we're going to put, put that big guy in there. And that, they're all full up. Okay, so it's, uh, thank you very much for watching and it's goodbye from me. And goodbye from me. Take care and have a lovely day.